Welcome back. All right, this is going to be a little short video. We're just uh, just did an oil change on a 2004 Toyota Highlander, um, and I want to reset the check engine or the uh, oil reminder light. So uh, I don't believe it's on. We're going to find out here in just a second, but we're going to reset it. I'm going to show you how to do that real quick. Um, I'll walk over here to the vehicle. <clears throat> I changed the oil in it last night. Okay. Want it in that position. I'll try to get this camera to stay in place. All right, so it's at the odometer reading, okay? So turn it to the off position, hold the button down, and then roll the key on. When it goes to zero, all zeros, you're set. That's it. So we'll turn it off. Oh. There we go. This one's got a little over a quarter million miles on it. Still runs good. It's in really good shape. It's having a little bit of a steering column shutter type. It's not really a power steering pump. It sounds like a bearing or something in the steering column. I put, I lubed the intermediate shaft. Lube the intermediate shaft down below the column and where it goes through the firewall down to the steering rack. And I'm gonna go drive it and see if that helps him. It's cold in here. I'm gonna let this thing warm up. Then we're gonna go for a test drive. But I'm not gonna film that. Uh, this was just basically about the maintenance reminder, oil change reminder light, whatever you want to call it. It wasn't on because he changed the oil a little early. He's gonna go on a long trip in this, and I uh, want to make sure everything looked good before he went. So. Uh, Got his oil changed, got the tires inflated, topped off his uh, washer fluid, um, reset his light. That's about all we can do. All right. Thanks for watching. Hit the subscribe button if this was helpful. Uh, give me a like, share. Appreciate you. Come back next time. Thanks.